Hey everybody, welcome to Profit Copilot, it's Mick Meany here and today I'm going to issue a warning about affiliate marketing. Maybe you're involved in affiliate marketing and you're struggling to get results or maybe you are seeing great levels of success in affiliate marketing. Well, I've got a word of caution for you and this was prompted by an email from one of my subscribers who is now, feels like they are now stuck in a trap because of affiliate marketing. And this is something I have seen other people experience over the years. And it is the main reason why I have avoided going into affiliate marketing in any big way. And I'm gonna go through it with you now. So let me say that affiliate marketing is a great way to supplement your income. So if you have something else going on and you're looking for a side hustle, then affiliate marketing is it's a good option but it's not a good option if it is your only source of income. If everything you earn depends on affiliate marketing, then you're putting yourself in a pretty bad situation, and I'll tell you why. So my subscriber, she says that she now feels like she is dependent on other people to promote her products, and if they choose to not promote her products, she loses her income and that is a very bad place to be it's a dangerous place to be and she is not the only one who is experiencing this and I want you to think about why we do this internet marketing stuff why we create our own blogs why we build email lists is to become independent to become free isn't it if you're doing affiliate marketing and you're dependent on other people to sustain your business, then you, you're you not really in that position of freedom, not true freedom. Anyway, what tends to happen, it's a bit of a, cir a circle, it's a cycle. So one affiliate will promote someone else and then they will expect that their products are promoted in return. So it's this reciprocation is expected and that's not a bad thing. I mean, a lot of what we do in business is based on reciprocation, you know, and when that reciprocation falls down, then so do the relationships in a lot of cases. You know, it's not the reason why we um, become friends with people and, and all that stuff. But generally, you, you know, <laughs> there is that expectation in our industry, in our business. We support each other. And I think that's a very positive thing. So there are times in affiliate marketing when that is taken to an extreme and people's businesses depend on this reciprocation. So how do you avoid it? Well, what I would suggest is continue affiliate marketing as a side hustle, learn techniques through affiliate marketing. I'm not saying you should avoid it entirely. I think it's, it's absolutely got its place when it's done right. And this is the thing, a lot of people aren't doing it in the right way. They're building businesses based around other people's businesses, which is, is, is not, um, it's not the way to true independence and freedom. So what I would say is do affiliate marketing in moderation. Keep it going. I do it myself. I, I do a level of affiliate marketing, but never too much. So it's always supplemental to my income. I would say put energy into building your own products, your own email list, your own following online, building, build your own audience. It doesn't require promotion on other people's websites or email lists. So invest into building your own authority website where you have a constant supply of fresh traffic and leads coming into your business for free. And I have actually seen people fall into the trap of affiliate marketing time and time again. So I decided in my business, I was not going to fall into that trap. And I specifically decided on using software that restricts me from having affiliate marketing at any meaning, meaningful level in my business. So my autoresponder at the moment is Active Campaign, And we all know they're not very keen on affiliate marketing. So when people <laughs> come to me and they say, can you promote my product? My hands are tied. Uh, Active campaign doesn't allow it, you know, for the most part. So I can't, even if I wanted to, you know, so there's that. Secondly, 
the membership software that I use, Member Mouse, that doesn't integrate with most of the big affiliate platforms. So I'm restricted there. I, I am forced to get traffic to the site myself. I am forced to build my own authority site. I have to do it the hard way. I can't take any shortcuts by using other people's email lists and giving them a commission on uh, on uh, my income. So <laughs> that's it. It's, it's, it. You know, affiliate marketing is a bit of a trap if you don't do it right. I'm not. I'm not trying to hate on affiliate marketing. I think it's wonderful. It, it, it offers a real positive thing in our world when it's done right. And it has to be done in a, a conscientious way, a way that protects your business for the future. There you go. I know this is a bit controversial. That's the point. It's supposed to be controversial. Um if you've liked it, if you don't like it, hit the button below, let me know and subscribe to the channel. You get more videos like this. Maybe not exactly like this one because I am having a bit of a rant, but there you go. Uh, subscribe to the channel and I'll send you another video tomorrow. Thank you for watching and be careful out there. Be careful about who you work with and who you listen to. There's a lot of sharks and shady people out there. If it sounds too good to be true, it's probably too good to be true. See you tomorrow.